Hello, my name is Samuel Scroggs, and in this lesson, we're going to learn how to both install and uninstall the Altum 5-band multispectral sensor for the Siastro Bromor PPX. Before beginning the installation process, make sure that you've gathered the sensor bay cover, the collar with five 3M screws, the 2.5 millimeter hex key, the Phillips head screwdriver, and the Altum 5-band multispectral sensor along with its attached GPS unit. Before inserting the sensor into the sensor bay, make sure the USB key which holds the sensor data is attached. Also, confirm that all the nuts in the sensor seat are tightened. While inserting the sensor, make sure that the corners of the GPS fins, shown here, are underneath the sensor bay rim, not sticking out above it. Looking at the bottom of the fuselage, make sure that the sensor is not caught on the edge of the mounting hole and is fully visible. The following clip shows the installation of the sensor. To flip the fuselage over, First support the underside of the sensor. Use the other hand to support underneath the fuselage and flip it over. While the fuselage is flipped over, make sure not to rest the PPK mast on your work surface as to avoid damage. While supporting the sensor with one hand, use the 2.5mm hex key to seat each screw one at a time. Once all screws have been seated, proceed to tighten them until secure. To make sure that the collar is properly installed, ensure that there are no gaps between the collar and the fuselage. If gaps exist, then there are screws that need to be further tightened. Next, plug the datalink cable into the datalink port. Make sure to screw in the Phillips head screw into the top screw hole on the cable. To install the sensor cover, lay the sensor cover so that it is near flush with the sensor bay. You may need to adjust to an angle if you do not succeed. Then, wiggle the sensor bay cover so that it slides into the edge of the sensor bay. Finally, push the end of the cover near the RTK cover down until the entire cover is flush. We will now move on to disassembly of the sensor. Before we begin to take out the sensor, we must first remove the data link cable from its port. Remember to unscrew the screw that holds the cable in place using a Phillips head screwdriver before removing the cable. We will now flip over the fuselage using the same technique as during the installation of the sensor. Again, put one hand under the sensor and the other on top of the fuselage and flip it over. Remember not to rest the PPK mast on the work surface. Next, use the 2.5mm hex key to unscrew the screws on the collar. Make sure to support the sensor during this process so it does not fall out and get damaged. After using the same technique to flip the fuselage back over, we can finally remove the sensor. The sensor is removed by simply rotating it and pulling it out. You should now be able to install and uninstall the Altum 5-band multispectral sensor for the Siastro Bromor PPX. For more training material, click the link in the description. Thank you.